Hello, <coughs> this is video uh, about how to make custom attribute in Magenta 2. So, at the screen right now we have Magenta 2 and this is admin panel where we can see customers. In demo data we have default customer and we have attrib customer attributes over here. So, they, they can be available in the admin panel or registration form, addresses form or any other form. I think you already read articles so you pro probably uh, already know what how to select what form should be there. So let me show you how to make extension which add custom customer attribute for Magenta 2. So we will need SSH access or FTP if you have one of them. I will use SSH instead. And you already have access probably to GitHub with this extension. And let's start. So we will do our extension at the app code Sasha's customer attribute. Next, please. We go into app code So over here we will need only two folders It's etc and sita ETC folder is used for extension configuration. It's same, similar to what it used to be at Magenta 1.x. And but over there will be much more XML files, and they will be different depend of what your extensions will do. And setup it's used for installation of different data or database tables or in adding any values. So exactly our setup folder will add new values to Magenta. It will add new customer attribute, which will be shown at the admin edit page. So let's start from the declaration of our extension that Magenta can find it and uh, register register in in the system. So we're going back to the GitHub. And we're making module.xml file. So this file it has module name, it has module dependency. So we have to make dependent module magenta customer because we without customer magenta module we will not be able to make customer attribute. And here we set up version. If we set up make new version we update it here and we make upgrade script in our setup folder so in the, in our case i will just copy this code to the module xml file done with it and next we need to open and set up file which actually make our attribute it calls install data so over here we use magenta customer stuff factory and other places in our setup element and if you can see, and as you can see we're making new attribute with retriever customer entity config in this type and we make new attribute we set up pro properties of our attribute and also we define what will be 
entity type it will be customer and we define what will be code of our attribute it's magenta username like and at the label it will be uh, our label which will be shown on the front end type it will be type of the field varchar or it will be integer or select field it's pretty similar to magenta 1.x and also we can set up we need to add this attribute to be shown in forms so it, it's here we are doing it and we have parameter which says use used in forms and right now we add add it only to the admin customer edit form so when you will make another attribute you can include different other forms you can find them in our article and then we just save an attribute so let me copy it Okay, so files are here. So we trying to open our customer, and we don't see anything. We don't see anything because Magento two have set up interface. So we need to apply upgrade script. It can be done from the command line, from the shell. Magenta 2 has a shell mechanism, which allows us to launch different, execute to different commands. So in this case, we need setup upgrade. Because we are upgrading our Magenta, we are upgrading our extension to next versions and Magenta will go and check all modules and install new data and, or upgrade it. So as you can see we have module such as customer attribute and we have data for it. So let's check if, if our attribute will be shown right now. It takes some time to load customer attributes and customer edit page in the Magenta Merchant release. So we have to, to wait some time and it will be shown. Yeah, so it seems it's still loading and maybe it's some Magenta. 1.0 issues development release but we will once it will be loaded we will see our customer and new customer attribute as we have on our article so hope it was helpful for you and enjoy magenta too